honestly, I have never looked better. And I know this, so you could tell me if you want. You could leave a comment about how great I look and my hair looks, but I already know. start vlogging like when Nick and I got back to Nashville because we did some stuff we actually planted all of these so I probably should have put this in the vlog we also um, planted this got a new hose Nick put that up on the wall and then we moved this plant it was right where these lavender ones were <laughs> He doesn't even want his ball anymore. He's so damn tired. Come on. Get, ah, get out of my flowers! Just planted these little flowers. Super cute. And then I got these. Um, they were really cheap. They're only like three bucks. And then these guys, we put in these uh, little jasmine plants. They're super fragrant and stuff. <laughs> and we're gonna go drive around the neighborhood right now for fun. Tell everybody what we got for, oh, that's the bee. I think there's a bee. Is that a bee or just a giant fly? fly. Oh, jeez. Tell everybody what we got for Leo. A vibrator. <laughs> Not the new kitchen towel. Use one of the old ones. He's right there. <laughs> sure. He flew away. Uh, we got him a vibrating collar with this remote right here so that when he barks, we can. He's not barking anymore. He's not barking anymore. Oh, no, good. I can do a shock, but I don't think that's necessary. He's like five pounds. Are you out of breath? Huh? I just got this new carpet. Nick actually made this table. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty sweet. Very cool. I need to do a house tour soon. I know, I'm aware. I just wanna get the mirror up on that wall and a couple other things done before I do that. I had this piece made right here. Very cool.
wish I didn't have fake eyelashes on right now. They're kind of fucking irritating me. Uh, Leo! Oh, you're eating your food, sorry. Go back, go back to what you're doing. Good morning. This guy already got up and did so much shit. Putting in Nest thermostats. This one's being a little bitch. The one upstairs is perfect. I think this thermostat's messed up from the last house. We ended up getting ramen last night. It was not good. How do you give me ramen with a not ramen egg? Like I know how to make a good ramen egg and they freaking gypped me. They just put like a plain hard boiled egg in there. Who do they think they're messing with? Well, that looks really good. I seriously just ran water through the same pod. Like look at that. Ew. Putting his ass to work. You really look like Brody Jenner right now. <laughs> this mirror just got delivered. It's gonna go right there. I'm thinking I want some like sort of neon sign something or other. Probably live, laugh, love. What do you think? Live, laugh, love? Yeah. Oh, for sure. <laughs> this is kind of like the color scheme of the pinks because so I don't buy the wrong kind of pink. Got some plants. We'll show you that. He's gonna make a garden bed tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow, garden bed. <laughs> hey, Nancy. Yeah. You want to take a shot at tequila? Uh, yeah, I guess you could force me. <laughs> yep. I'm going to force you. Cheers. Cheers to April. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's coming up. Don't try and pull an April oh, Fool's on me, fool. Really Ooh, that's a pretty one. <laughs> pretty? <laughs> the cup or the tequila? The tequila. <laughs> wow. The cute thing that I wrote, and then you're drawing a limp wiener. Men never grow up. Look at that little dimple. It's so cute. I will too grow up. No. <laughs> Ooh, looks good. Okay, so what do you think, even though it's round? Uh, I like it. <laughs> I like it? I like it. I like it. So now I'm going to take this out and sell this or something. So I'm thinking about Airbnb being this house out a handful of times a month when I'm gone. Um, so I thought that'd be kind of fun. Um, this would be like a secondary home. I think I'm gonna buy a home in California too. So uh, let me know what you guys think. Also try to figure out what to do out here. I was seeing like a little fire pit out there. I think I'm gonna um, plant some Morning Glory Seeds right here. Got a nice mellow morning with a favorite towel. Huh. You so cute. Where are the other two? <laughs> Probably wreaking some havoc or shitting in a corner. This is where the garden bed's gonna go from the edge of this over here. Huh. Little nugget. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and plant these right over here. Brixton is buried right here, so I'm gonna plant some of these kind of here. This already has a plant growing. <laughs> it's coming along. 
Okay, so these are the ones that have to start indoors. So I'm gonna plant them in here and then a couple in here. We just finished putting all the soil in here. We had to go back to Home Depot again. And I'm kind of placing these right now where, like, based on what they should be next to. Don't tell anyone that I'm wearing jeans with Nikes, okay? And the diner's name is California. Honestly, I have never looked better. And I know this, so you could tell me if you want. You could leave a comment about how great. I look and my hair looks, but I already know. Nick is still sleeping. Um, we have two more mornings together, this one and tomorrow, and then he goes back to California. Um, I'm gonna make myself some coffee, go check on my animals, it's like my favorite thing to do. My tits hurt so bad today, no idea why. Got off my period like five days ago, ish. So Nick asked me to make a sign last night for our garden, right? So I made this. Nick and Kristen's established 20. Put all that hard work into that. What does he come back with? Garden de la Corona. Tomorrow I'm gonna start doing that every morning again and do some little workouts and I've got bands and whatnot. So I'm gonna be doing a little bit of that. Um yeah, that's so that'll feel good and I'm excited to just kinda get back to like my YouTube stuff. Like usually when I hang out with Nick I like to take a break from uh social media and just enjoy his company. I've been doing a lot of stuff like around the house too, which has been really nice, like stuff that like I mean, you guys have seen some of it, like that I would have to pay someone a lot of money to do. So it's been really, really nice to be able to save money there. And I was posting on my animal channel, this or my animal YouTube channel this morning. Is that attached to my face? Or my, oh, it's on the screen. I was like, what is that? It's like a black dot. Um, are you ready for breakfast? Is that what that means? Come here, let me have that that I am excited to get a pig. I've been wanting to get um, a, like a pig uh, for quite a while actually. I've been talking about it probably for a couple years, but I don't have this, I mean I do have this space right now, I could make it work, I have a nice yard, but I want like some acreage so I can get more pigs. I'd like to save some from slaughterhouses. Not sure how I'm gonna do that. Is that your ball? I'm talking to the nice people. Could you wait like two seconds? I literally almost drooled to myself. On that note, I'm gonna make Leo some food. I'm gonna go check out my plants. I would really love to see a cardinal eat out of my bird feeder over here that I hung up yesterday. But uh, I haven't seen a bird go anywhere near it yet, so I think they don't know it's there. I wanted to share with you guys the collar that we've been using for Leo. It is a shock or a vibration collar, and you can choose what you do here. We have not shocked him, he's very little. I don't think that he needs that, but should you ever need it in like an emergency, it's here. You can set the level for the vibration and the shock separately. And there's a little sound off button, so like you can do that every time before you do it so they know, oh, when I hear that sound, that's like my one warning. But 
Leo has had a yes, I'm talking about you, has had a barking problem for his whole life and it drives me up a wall. He will go outside <coughs> bark and bark and bark and bark and bark at her neighbors. He would also, anytime you would get outside that front door, bolt and just go to people's houses and like, so anyways, Nick's been teaching him with this, with the vibrate setting. The moment it's touched, he comes right back running to us. So actually we have been able to take him outside now. We play ball in the driveway and he stays with us. He stays in the yard. He has not really barked at all. Like the few times that he has barked, he gets vibrated and he comes running back to us. So this has been like a lifesaver. So if you're having issues with training a dog in general, I've tried everything. I highly recommend this. There are other things that people do with like cans with like pennies in them and stuff. And like, that's just so loud and obnoxious. I just put the collar on him. We use this and like, I'll show you, um, I'll link you guys to this in the description box. But like, sorry to just talk about that for like five minutes, but I feel like I'm not the only one with a dog with little man syndrome that just barks and barks and barks. And it's so obnoxious when I'm upstairs filming. Now I can just literally look out the window and do the vibrate and he comes running inside. Hey, come here, come here. He's got so much fur, but this is the collar right here. So it works good and it's good for little dogs. They have different sizes and stuff in case you need like a big one. Guess who's gonna get a haircut from mommy? Are, are you scared? That's rude. Can you just... We think this looks really good. I really like this sign edition. It's better than I even thought it was gonna be because I thought it was gonna be nailed to the outside. I like this better. Um, the Swiss shard doesn't look so hot. <sighs> Kinda looks like it's on its deathbed, but uh, we'll see, we'll see. Okay, so last night is the first night that I have ever fallen asleep on a couch. Literally, the first time I've ever fallen asleep on a couch. So, we, uh, Nick woke us both up at like 4 a.m. I had no idea that it was, um, I've never fallen asleep on a couch. That's crazy. Um, needless to say, I had a little bit too much to drink last night, and I heard that Corona was going to be, my mom texted me, she's like, you better stock up on Corona. Um, I think they're not gonna be, uh, producing as much beer. I don't know if people are superstitious or what, but I was like, I think I'm good on it. Like, I think I've had enough beer and tequila shots to last me a very long time and actually would like to take this time to get a little healthy. Um, oh, Leo's pooping. I wanted to come out and check out our garden. It is looking pretty good. Um, we ended up putting the leafier stuff over here so it got more shade because it needs four to six, uh, or three to six hours of shade a day, I think. It's not gonna quite get that here, but everything looks pretty good. The, um, this was looking kind of sad yesterday. This kind of all perked up except for that one. So we'll see what happens, but the rest of this is looking pretty good. So I'm just trying to give it a nice good water before it gets, oh, look at the rainbow, um, before it gets too sunny and the leaves burn. Sad day, we're taking Nick to the airport right now. Uh, first night without Nick since we were back in San Diego and I miss the absolute crap out of him. Um, I just went upstairs and kind of messed with the rabbit area, fed them a salad and whatnot, and that's why I'm like, I sound a little congested. I'm, I'm actually like allergic to hay. So every time I'm in there and pet the rabbits, I get like a little uh, congested and my eyes get itchy and stuff, so that's not pleasant. 
I'm gonna make breakfast for dinner right now uh, and sit on the couch. I have a pounding headache. So I'm gonna sit down with some food and I planted some um, dandelion seeds today for my rabbits, so that's great. I did a lot of cleaning up. My um, uh, kitchen is looking pretty good. Um, still have to clean up a little bit over here, but got it cleaned up pretty good in here. Um, I hate when my house is messy, so it felt really good to like clean up. I might have to, I have to clean my room tomorrow. Maybe we'll do a little time lapse of that, but I will catch you guys tomorrow. Also, my eyelashes, usually these are always gone first, but this time this one is not doing so hot. I might have to just remove these because they're starting to look a little scraggly. It is an absolutely beautiful day. Um, let's do a little update on everything. So here is the stargazer lily. There's another one planted here and the only other ones that I'm seeing up right now are this one and this one. I oh, don't know, those don't look so good. Um, looks like one's popping up right there too. So those haven't done a whole lot. This one's changed colors a little bit. I don't know if this is a flower or more leaves, but it's looking good nonetheless. And this is day three that we've had the garden planted. Um, it's looking pretty good. These are doing better. Um, actually, all of them are doing better. They're standing up a little bit better. And yeah, I think everything's looking really good. Some strawberries under here. Little baby ones here and there. I'm hoping the squirrels don't eat my strawberries before I get to. <laughs> I got my coffee. Now we're gonna go upstairs to check on the animals. This is what I like to do every single morning with my coffee. Shuggies have made a mess. An absolute mess. Lucy Lou. Shit. Just realized that I left some food out last night that I was feeding the snakes and I was gonna give this to Nash today. I was like, that's gonna go in the trash. Hi, good morning. He's so cute. He always greets me right here. He's always right here. So what I'll typically do is mist all my cages in the morning that need to be misted, which is pretty much all of them. Some get a little more than others. And down here, oh, you ate some of your salad, yay. Good morning, Dolly. And then I'll also collect any insects or salad that haven't been eaten. You did good, you ate a lot of your salad, unless it just shriveled up. Good girl. What's the deal? Why are you so dark lately and why are you not going in your water? We're gonna clean this out today, actually. All right, so I have put up a video today. I have put up another IGTV video today and, ooh, there's a bird in my yard eating the seeds, so cute. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start next week's vlog today. I still need to figure out like a, the schedule that I wanna do for these, like I don't really know, I haven't vlogged in so long. Um, but I'm gonna cook some stuff today and do some more IGTV videos with that. I really love crystal clear makeups, like the way that she does her like cooking with her kind of videos, like on, IGTV, I really like those. I think they're fun to watch, so I'd like to create some of those for you guys with my own tastes and likes and recipes and things like that. So I'm gonna do a couple of those today and I'm gonna go play ball with Leo outside for a little bit and then I'm gonna get started doing those. So thanks for watching this vlog, you guys. If you liked it, then give it a thumbs up and let me know. Um, that uh, is always encouraging for me to make more if I know you guys like it. I mean, I like it, so I'm gonna do it anyway, but it's always nice to know that you like what I'm putting out and all that good stuff, because after all, you guys are the ones like consuming content on YouTube, right? So, 
stay safe you guys. I hope you guys are quarantining well and not losing your freaking minds and uh, stay safe and I will see you guys in the next vlog or video, video, not vlog necessarily.